Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new Disneyland Paris vlog series. Hello. So it is currently 2.54. That's why I look like this. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm very proud of ourselves. We're very prompt. Normally we're rushing about a bit but today we're up, we're we ready. Leave at three. We did get like we went to bed and had made sure that we had a few hours sleep as yeah. well, which I think has helped. Um, but yeah, we are off to Disneyland Paris. Our Eurotunnel is at 6.20, so we are about to set off. And this is our October trip, so it's all going to be Halloween. Uh, we're going to be there for the Halloween festival, and we are also going to see Avengers Campus for the first time. So lots of firsts for this trip, which Can't I'm really, really excited about. I can do this all day. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got my Marvel Spirit jersey on. Uh, and if you're new to the channel, my name's Martin. And my name's Helena. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, we hope you enjoy coming along with us. Let's go. So we've made it to the Euro Tunnel. And we've got perfect spot right in front of the board. Now for the previous trips, no uh, we haven't been able to get like slap bang in the middle <laughs> of the sign. But we have today. <laughs> the drive-in cinema sign at the Euro Tunnel. Uh, so we are V5, so we're boarding, well 6.20 is the actual Eurotunnel, it said 45 minutes till they start calling. We could have got an earlier one, but it would have been pretty much like go straight there. But I'd like to get my coffee. Let's get it. <laughs> and we're using the Waze app, we use the Waze app to get here, which is just better because when we drive through the night it's like, there's a lot of road closures, so that's really helpful. Now you can select the voice you want on Waze, and I've got Terminator <laughs> at the moment. But just a word of warning, if you do have that voice and there's a hazard on the road, you will follow saying there's a hazard by shouting, GET DOWN! It's scary. It's quite an alarming <laughs> volume. It's so. quite scary. <laughs> I got used to it. But yeah, it, the first time it happened, it was like, what? <laughs> the lights in the trees give me Christmas vibes. I know, I used to think they um, were only up for Christmas, but they're always up. <laughs> mm. Some Tesla charging stations over there. <laughs> Giant, guess who? <laughs> Is that always there? No, that's new. <laughs> <Who am I? laughs> so Starbucks is open. I got an English breakfast tea. And Martin got a little, is it a bacon or sausage, oh, sausage, sausage roll? Sausage sandwich. And a coffee. And then I got a croissant. Holiday begins. We're on our way. We're on our way. <laughs> very, very excited. <laughs> Just about to board the Eurotown. It's a little bit busier than it's been mm. on our previous trips in there. Because it's still quite early. I think it's not even six o'clock yet. 5.29 5.29 um, Still dark outside Gotta do it as my reminder Drive on the right Drive on the right Drive on the right We're in France! <laughs> <laughs> It is so bright. The sun has been beaming on my face um, this whole road trip, which has been lovely. Uh, but Martin is definitely in the dark right now. <laughs> we can't see him. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, but we, it, the time is 10. We have about an hour and 10 minutes left. It's been a really good journey. Touch wood, yeah. Really, really quick. Um, so we might get there for about half 11, which is earlier than we thought. Um, we've just been listening to Disney tunes. Um, that's it really, Watched a bit been of, doing a bit of a road trip. A bit of Mary Poppins uh, Returns. We watched a little bit of Mary Poppins Returns. We saw Mary Poppins um, on the West End last week. So we're obsessed. And we love it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're heading in. We did like a rough plan. Yeah. Um, so we popped down the times of everything. We're going to head to Avengers Campus first and then we're going to get some food have a break, maybe go back to the hotel, we're not sure, and then head to Disneyland Park later to catch the Disney villains nighttime show and fireworks. So that's like the rough plan for the day, um, but we're just gonna see what happens, see how busy it is and everything. 
Um, but yeah, we're excited. We're getting close now. Just been listening to Disney. I'm about to put on some Disneyland Paris tunes. Because <laughs> I feel like we need Are You Brave Enough? I feel like we need Ready for the Ride. Come on, Kissy Lamine. <laughs> we need these all <laughs> to get us in the mood. Uh, the parking is 30 euros. Yeah, I think that's gone up, hasn't that, it? That, well, I remember it being like 20 something. I think it was 25. 25, um, but yeah, it's 30 euros. So bear that in mind if you are um, parking because whew, that's gone up a bit. Um, but we um, use Martin's Infinity Pass, so we're just about to park. We think that if you stay at the hotels though, you get the parking included. Yeah, let, if, if anyone knows and can clarify that in the comments, let us know. It's been that Because we've had a few questions. <laughs> but when we stayed in a Disney hotel, we're pretty sure they gave us a little card, which meant we didn't have to pay for parking. Yeah, I think so. Um, I mean, they must do. Yeah. Otherwise, that's a lot of extra money. I don't, I don't recall paying. No. Um, but yeah, so we are here, we're going to park up and then we're going to head into the parks. Um, little side note, when we were driving up, <laughs> we started to notice loads of queues going into the service stations. At first we were a bit like, oh, oh maybe sorry. it's just a bit busy. Um, but then we researched and there's an oil strike. Um, whilst we're here this is day number 13 of the strike um but the petrol stations are starting to run out of fuel a third of the petrol stations um have run out so <laughs> we didn't know we didn't know about this we've had we've got enough petrol to get here and kind of drive to the parks each day but we we don't have enough to get all the way back to the euro no, we don't we don't need to drive to the parks because oh walk. yeah we don't need to drive to the parks yeah we don't <laughs> <laughs> we won't have enough petrol to get back. Back to the Euro Tunnel. So we're gonna have to see how things go. We're hoping that it gets resolved over the next few days and then maybe the queues die down. And obviously the big thing is, if if everywhere runs out of fuel, then um, I don't know, I don't know what we'll do. <laughs> uh, but we'll keep you updated obviously in the vlogs. The magic is calling, calling, calling. <laughs> Oh, so yeah, we think we're gonna head to Walt Disney Studios and we're gonna check out Avengers Campus. We're not sure we're gonna be able to do the rides just yet. The uh, queue times are long because Spider-Man was down for the whole of the morning. So yeah. I think it's just come back on. Um, but we're gonna go have a look and hopefully get some food. Yes, <laughs> we'd love to get into, is it Stark? Stark Kitchen. Stark Kitchen, yeah, we'd love to do that. Um, so yeah, we will see. But this is so exciting, seeing a brand new land. It's going to look so weird. Like, it's been so long since we've seen anything new at Disneyland Paris. And I'm going to like try and remember back to what it was like beforehand. Yeah. You know, we had Armageddon and uh, Restaurant de Stars. When we used to do the buffet meal plan, we used to eat at Restaurant de Stars because it was like the only buffet place to eat in Walt Disney Studios. Yeah. So we used to eat there all the time. Uh, <laughs> oh, and by the way, there's a bit of a chill in the air. It's very sunny, right? <laughs> but it definitely is colder. I know, we used to, we're summer. We used to summer now. Used to wearing used to my shorts just around. We used to come in uh, winter. Yeah. We've been in summer this year. <laughs> we are here. Happy? I'm so happy. I'm excited. <laughs> it feels surreal that we're going to actually see it. I know. It's been so long in the, like, the planning and construction. We've peered through the walls before. <gasps> That's Goofy. Oh. And Pluto. I've walked past this so many times and obviously I've just seen like the statue but I didn't realise all the decoration inside the actual the fountain, the mosaic the of the hidden Mickeys. <laughs> I like the colours as well. People have thrown in their money for good luck. Alright, so we've just come through the so walkway. Weird. There's actually going to be something there. And we're going to go around <laughs> the corner and we're going to see it. <laughs> There's no wall! <laughs> it already feels so much bigger, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, man! There's Thor on a 30th poster. So we're heading in 
So I think where Armageddon was, I think that's now the Spider-Man ride, but we'll see when we go in. And then I think the Pim's Kitchen, Pim Kitchen is where Restaurant of the Stars was. Restaurant of the Stars was. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Avengers Campus. <laughs> Oh, so we're at the sign of Avengers Campus. We got some photos and the music is playing. I feel very heroic. <laughs> this is Pim Kitchen. Ant-Man's doing a meet and greet. That's such a cool meet and greet. The costume looks amazing. Shrinking particles, enlarging particles. Apologies, I don't know the name of the Spider-Man ride just yet. But yeah, this is where it is. It's currently... Web adventure. Actually, he comes up as well. Oh yeah, that's on our bucket list, isn't it? To try and catch Spider-Man when he comes out. And I really, really want to see the Wakanda. Yes. So there's single rider, there's premier access, and then there's the normal entrance. If it doesn't die down, we might do premier access just for that one. Yes. Um, we'll see. <laughs> it's quite busy today. <laughs> So we found Stark Factory and we're a little bit hungry from our journey so we think we're gonna eat a bit early. I think it's about half twelve I don't want to go but we're ready for lunch. And see this whole <laughs> it doesn't look too busy which is good. It's incredible. That's People are just nipping inside to get a photo. <laughs> so we picked up a tray and then we just pick what we want, put up, pop it on the tray and then pay at the end. Having my lunch at the factory. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the different types of pasta, bolognese, mac and cheese, and this one's Neapolitan sauce and basil, pizza four seasons, parma ham it looks like at the end, I think the parma ham one, I think that's going to be the one that we'd like the most, I think the parma ham, yeah, this one is, well this one's a margarita essentially but it's just got um, olives on top of it, this one, So we're going to do a share, we're going to have half and half. half, and half. There's the Stark Factory pizza oven. Oh, and there's a dessert. 
The thunder cake, caramel milk chocolate. Oh, I'll have one of those. <laughs> so we got our food and then we walked through to what we think is the Peggy Carter section. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah, we'll have to have a look at that. You can actually sit in it. Oh, they're moving. Oh, do you want to go? Moving. Go, go, go. <laughs> so the reason I said to move is because you can sit at the desk. There's Peggy Carter's name. And here's the desk, the chair, the shield. Photos, there's the helmet, <gasps> her hat <laughs> on the wall. I'm letting the food get all cold because I'm busy looking at all these little details. So on the drawers here, we've got different files. So we've got H. Stark Inventions, Project Rebirth, Hydra Intel, and then I've just noticed this drawer, Steve Rogers Case Files. Sorry for the glare, but it's good. We can see across the way, Thor is out. <laughs> so we have been tucking in and I'm really enjoying the pasta. Really it's nice. really nice. And the pizza was good too. A little bit salty, that's our only um, criticism, but the pizza's really nice. <laughs> and then we just turn round and there's Iron Man. This is so fun. <laughs> it doesn't stop. Right, time to dig in the thunder cake. Oh, it's, it's a lot softer than I thought it was going to be. It's like a mousse. Ooh, yeah. So we caught the show again. Uh, it was just as we were exiting the start kitchen. And yeah, it was about five to. So I think that was about an hour after the other one. Yeah, I'd say. And we're going in Stark Equipment. Oh no, we're going in Mission Equipment. <laughs> so this is the big merch store, Avengers Fleece. Is that a spirit jersey? Uh, okay. Okay, and then Avengers, Avengers Campus. Campus. Oh, awesome. Quite simple, but nice. And that is... 65. Miss Marvel Loungefly. <laughs> Avengers Campus Lanyard. So I remember, was it on the last trip where we were looking all, I was looking all over for this mug and they brought it back in. Mm -hmm. His face comes out. Got water bottles, Spider-Man, Thor, Love and Thunder. The music is playing. It's Iron Man! was playing we thought something was happening Iron Man came out and then they all came out so this is the training center and I think this is where you can meet one of the superheroes I think you do a virtual queue for that training center Black, Widow, Black Widow's out <laughs> <laughs> I hope you can see things. It is so sunny. It's a beautiful day. <laughs> so this is Ooh. Avengers Flight Force. Happening. <laughs> oh, it's Friday. Talking to us. I'm in awe of this place. There's just so much going on. So this is the window to the shop. That's uh, where you can get the. Is this what you can buy? On. As if you can buy that, wow. <laughs> That's crazy. And then it'll do different things on the on ride. Adventure. I really want to get on my adventure. Yeah, me too. 
<laughs> it's like an Iron Man one. I think you get more points as well. Get a wear it. hoodie. We did go in the shop, but it was rather busy. We were hoping to head back later on, maybe like late afternoon. Yeah. Because we've heard that it can get a little bit quieter. Mm. So that was epic. It was cool. <laughs> really cool. We've decided to carry on now to Disneyland Park and then we'll go back later after we've had our break uh, back to Avengers Campus and see whether we can venture on the rides. It did look, it, the rides looked epic. The entrance to Flight Force looked really cool. And, you, and I've heard that the queue yeah. is really good. Yeah. <laughs> and you could hear people walking around saying that they'd been on Spider-Man and that they loved it. Yeah, I am really excited for Spider-Man just because I feel like that's going to be completely different to anything else um, that Disneyland have really. Yeah. Like, I can't think of a ride that's the no, the only thing I can think of is, is, is not Disney, but yeah, yeah. Ninjago at Legoland. Uh, but yeah, let's go and see. We might watch the Halloween parade. Well, it starts at 10 to. Oh, the time is 23. So I feel, feel like we may get stuck anyway <laughs> um, and we might have to watch it. it wouldn't be a bad thing no and we get to say hello to happy chappy phantom and melanie because they're in it as always we get a picture at what was or is the engagement spot i am liking that they've changed the colors of mickey in the middle so orange and purple fit in with halloween oh Oh, hasn't he got the um, phantom? It looks like he's got the phantom outfit on. The way that the colours are spread out, it looks like that purple's there, the collar, and then it looks like a top hat. The music just makes you want to dance. <laughs> it probably is my favourite entrance to any Disney park. <laughs> They're still working away on the Disneyland Hotel. When will it reopen? This is so cute! Here he is, close up. Yeah, it looks like a top hat but on his head there. I love it! I said there was a chill in the air earlier, now I'm too hot. And we're going in. Are you ready for all the Halloween? Oh yeah! Been so caught up in the Avengers, forgot about Halloween. Forgot about Halloween. <laughs> oh, it is cool. Oh, the pumpkins. I do love how they change all the flower colours. Yeah, so all these flowers, purples and orange, and then you got all the pumpkins around the thirtieth sign. We've stumbled across time to shine. <laughs> it's an abridged version. <laughs> Ghosts have invaded again. <laughs> I love how they've all got 30th badges on. Helena's saying she's made friends with a ghost. How did you get talking? Well, I was waiting for you. Was, it, like was it about his, his tooth? He's having issues. So that was time to shine which is a shorter version of Dream and Shine Brighter. Yeah. Because <laughs> the, the other one, Dream and Shine Brighter, they go up on the podiums and stuff. Yeah, and I think there's more dancers. Right. There are more dancers than that. Okay. And there are more floats, because you had Mickey and Minnie float, and then you had two That's floats. right, yeah. And that's just taking a break until... January. January, yeah. And then we're just camping out now to watch the Mickey Halloween celebration. <laughs> one of my favourite bits of theming is the lights with the pumpkins and the witch. <laughs> We're a bit perplexed. We're wondering whether the celebration has started. The app is now saying next show tomorrow. I feel like I can hear something. But yeah, maybe it has started. 
Maybe it says that once the show once started. Once the time. <laughs> Hopefully. We'll see, we'll wait it out a little bit longer. <laughs> Spooky music. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it doesn't go all the way around. <laughs> We're in the wrong place. I forgot a key piece of information. And that, I'm tired. <laughs> and that was that in that show they go up onto the stages in the centre. I wondered why it was taking so long to come down. <laughs> so. And then we sat in the wrong place. We sat in the wrong place. Yep. <laughs> we completely messed that up. Do not take any advice. From us. <laughs> well, we saw it as a parade first. <laughs> so tomorrow we're going to try and see it at the stages. Yes. Um, <laughs> oh, as soon as you said it'd be better to just watch it by the castle, I went. You twigged. I twigged. <laughs> so they do show, they do all stop, they go up and dance on the levels like Dreamshine Brighter, and then they come there to finish. That would make sense. So this is the Emporium, and Ralph, so Ralph Watch is still on because he's not there. That random ghost. There's that ghost. Maybe that's why they've taken them away. Maybe yeah. they just take them away for um, Halloween. It'd be a bit weird if you have both and then, or maybe Ralph said I won't work with that. <laughs> New guy Ralph is scared of the ghosts. <laughs> so we're heading into Frontierland, which is my favourite land at Halloween. It is just the best with all the full colours, all the pumpkin heads. Um, I love. They used to have like a big cocoa thing, but I don't think that's there this year. Um, but it might be if we walk further down, um, but I love it. It's just the best at Halloween. Just outside the Lucky Nugget and they've got spooky specials. The Evil Burger, Maleficent Sunday. Oh, that's what we saw when we um, were looking up. Yeah, I'm 
well. I mean, that is epic. Yeah. I'm we a need huge to. Fan of pistachio, though. We need to try some ghoulish snacks. Well, I want to go to my favourite place. Hyperion. Oh yeah. That's got a um, Halloween menu. Oh, nice. So we noticed that time's getting on. So uh, it is half two and we can check in from three. So in order to have a bit more time this evening, in the evening. we're going to head back to the hotel now and get all settled, have a little break, and then head back out. I'm excited for this evening. We're going to go in that shop that yeah. tends to have like the yeah. new merch. Oh no, we're going here. Oh no, entry. Entry, oh, yeah. we've got to go in this one. And we'll go and see if there's anything in there. Oh, wait a minute. Just realised we haven't shown you Main Street for Halloween. Love I love all the garlands. So they go all the way down Main Street to the castle and then they're behind us as well. Remember that year where there was that lost, Mickey, uh, lost Winnie the Pooh balloon? Oh yeah. Was it Winnie the Pooh or Mickey? And they were stuck there for ages. <laughs> um, but they're amazing. Uh, I just I just was saying they're very clever in the way that they subtly change all the colours. So like all of the um, the garlands, all of the flowers out front, really does make it feel autumnal. Like it's very subtle, but it's really clever. Um, I love it. It's making me want to come back for Christmas now. <laughs> so we're in. This is the shop that normally has all of the 30th merch. Oh, that's new. <laughs> This kind of reminds me of what they wear in Dream Shine Brighter. Oh yeah. Like the dancers. So this jacket is 70 euros. They have the spirit jersey that I was after for ages with rides. all the rides. I remember you really wanted this but <sighs> The only thing that I was wary about was because it was white. But I did want that. I wanted that for ages. How much is it? Good that it's back in the Oh, it's got 30 years of magic, magic. on the side. They must have had a restock. Uh, 65. 65. And then they have some matching ears too. They've got a 30th Christmas decorations. It's Mickey on Utopia. And <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty cute actually. We have been to the Christmas shop in a while. It was, um, there wasn't much when we went before. Maybe they've had more in. We've got Donald there on, on, um, Orbitron. on Orbitron. Do we have a Donald? Yeah, they're on um, Dumbo, aren't they? Ah, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. They are 20 euros. We're in the room! Although we got in the room a considerable time ago. <laughs> I realised when we were travelling back to the hotel uh, or travelling to the hotel to check in that I'd forgot something very important. Tea bags. <laughs> we bought milk in a service station on the way here because I also forgot the milk. <laughs> or we didn't bring any milk because we weren't sure whether we could bring it. Um, so yeah, we needed tea bags. So we walked uh, to the big shopping centre that's near. Uh, so we went there and we grabbed some tea bags. And we're back now, we're gonna have a quick cuppa, a bit of a relax, and then we'll head back into the park, but we'll do a little, little room tour. It's uh, identical to a studio we've stayed in before here at Hyde Park, but the location is just fantastic. And if I show you out of the window, this is, we found a parking space. You can actually park in any of these spaces uh, for free, but, it's not always guaranteed, like we were very lucky that this space was here and that the car is small enough to fit in this gap so Helda was able to guide me so we could park there um, if there's no spaces around here or you can even go like round the corner and check as well but if there's no spaces there then it's, I think it's 15 euros unless they've put it up uh, per night to park in the underground parking but what's good is we've got a full view of the car so we can keep an eye on it but also something to bear in mind is that if there's blue lines around, then you can't park in those bays. You can on a Sunday, can't you? Yeah, the weekend, I think. Um, but like round the front of the hotel, there's these um, bays with blue lines around. And if you park there during the week, then it's a big no-no. So we had our cup of tea. We had a little lie down, but it was short-lived. It's time to get going again. Parks close a little bit <laughs> earlier than when we were here in summer. Yes. So Walt Disney Studios closes at seven and Disneyland Park closes at nine. Yes. So we want to head in because we want to catch the last hour 
of Avengers Campus and see yes. if we can get on one of the rides. Well, yeah, the Spider-Man ride, um, Web Adventure. Mm -hmm. uh, it's in 55. Which now, a few of you have said that they do tend to advertise um, it as yeah. being longer, so we're thinking we might just risk it and join it. <laughs> Famous last words. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, then we'll head over to this land park. But we're going to finish this vlog. Uh, um, room tour uh, we'll do in the next uh, couple of vlogs. Yes. Um, not sure which one yet. But we will see you next time. If you like this video, hit the like button and also subscribe. And uh, hit the notification uh, button as well, the bell, if you want to be notified whenever we upload. See you in the next one. Bye. Toodle pipskies. I'll be alive.